Show me an Indian family without family conflicts. I don't like to say this as much as you don't like to listen to this. What happened was I overheard a conversation where this guy, he just went, he just went a bit hoo-ha and he just said, all Indian families have issues. Check it. And I started, I started looking into this. I was thinking, hey, whoa, why is this guy saying all Indian families have issues? I started looking into it and you start moving down the line of your Indian family and you start seeing that dad did not speak to this dad and that uncle was like this or I talk to one side of the family but I don't talk to the other side and check this one out you may know this I don't know if you know this one but at the wedding if you invite one person and you don't invite the other person conflict or if you invite that person and you invite that person if they meet at the wedding oh no that's going to be world war they're going to be they're going to be doing some sort of gang culture at your wedding now what am I saying here is we've grown so accustomed to Indian families having some sort of issues we kind of relate to this pretty well I would just be talking to someone and saying oh yeah yeah what's what's your family issue oh is the mother-in-law and the wife you know the, the, the whole thing don't worry I'm Indian I understand <laughs> now not to put a stereotype on all Indians or to say Indians aren't doing something right or anything like that but to our shock there are cultures out there that are doing it really well the common one is the African culture They've got a mantra that says Ubuntu, U-B-U-N-T-U. If you ever get around to Googling it, do check this one out. This culture is built on raising other people to raise ourselves. If we help the people around us, we help ourselves. We prosper on the basis of other people prospering and helping other people help other people prosper. There is a generation within the Indian culture that we could start to say, let's change this. Let's go out with a bit of a positive mindset to say if we're going to help someone else, if we help them raise themselves, we will actually raise ourselves. And this whole culture of helping another, helping them stand on their feet, letting them get bigger and then all of a sudden we've got a bit of a cultural shift and maybe we could reduce the number of family issues that are going around. I could talk about mental health for a good amount of time but if we don't sort out the situational factors, there's going to be a bit more issues going on further down the line you'll start having kids that don't talk to other family members or can't see their cousins little family issues do start gathering up and I'm just going to put it out there to say let's share this video on a positive note it's not to say there's a stereotype against Indians not to say Indians or families have just got issues etc we know most of the issues are tiny but because there isn't a culture to say let's raise the people around us let's help them raise other people if that culture was there, little problems could start getting diffused. Little problems, we could just start gathering help, talking to the people around us, them being more open to helping us, and loads of little positive points could start coming just with a cultural shift. So that's what this video is for. Thank you for watching, everyone. Hope to see you next time.